everybody, welcome to Franny's Square. Today I'm going to be reviewing this wig by Uniwigs. This wig is part of their Real Trust collection, which is a combination of human hair and heat-friendly synthetic fibers. This wig is called Diana, and I think she may have been inspired by Princess Diana. I kind of remember her wearing her hair like this at points. She's in the color B256, which is frosted cappuccino, but the highlights are done absolutely beautifully. It's not rooted, but highlighted so well. You can see there. And you don't need it rooted because this has a 100% hand-tied mono top. It does not have a lace front because you have the bangs, so you don't really need it. And you can wear them wispy like this, or you can wear them down like this. Now the advertising for this says, take it out of the box, shake it and go. And that's exactly what I did. I didn't style it, but it is a combination of 30% human hair and 70% heat friendly fibers. So you can use heat tools on this to style it. I did not, this is right out of the box. It's a wavy wig. It's 130% density, so it has nice body to it. You can see there, really nice. I, I have to say, I don't really like short hair on me or bangs, but I really like this style. This would be a great summer style, stick it on and go. Um, I think it looks really natural. It feels really natural. The cap size is small to medium and it's supposed to fit 21.25 inch to 21.75 inch circumference heads. I'm a 21.5 inch, so I'm smack in the middle. Fits me perfectly. I put it on, no extra space, and I haven't adjusted it. I am gonna show you the cap after I spin for you. I'm gonna try it on with some glasses here. Underneath the air tabs, no problem at all. I think I would probably wear this behind my ear like this a little bit, style it. I think that looks so adorable. <laughs> and I love it's not too shiny. It really looks very natural. Okay, I'm gonna take this outside, show you the color outside, and then I'm gonna come back in and show you the cap. Okay, so here I am outside. I apologize, there's a lot of people working around here, so you probably hear the machines. So you can see the platinum in it but it does also have some gold. Okay, so let's take a look at the cap now. Beautifully hand knotted. You have the whole mono top here. Look at that. Uh, nice velvety ear tabs and an extended nape in that same nice material. And you have the bra strap closures right here. No lace front, it's a silicone here. So it will help grip, especially if you don't have hair there, but you do have the bangs to cover it. Okay, so as I said, I've never had a human hair synthetic fiber combination wig, so I haven't washed one. I'm gonna go wash it now, and then once it dries, I will come back and show you what it looks like without doing any styling to it. So let's see what happens. Okay, so I just wanted to pop on here. I'm getting ready to work out, as you can see by my clothes but I washed Diana last night and just hung her to dry. I just shampooed her, hung her up, that's it. And she came out, same style. This is it, right off of the wig stand. So she does hold the style through the washing. I was concerned that the 30% human hair would relax in some way and you would see a difference, but to me, she looks the same. Good to know. 